Hey everybody, welcome back to Edgington, the city on the edge here in the wonderful Timber and Stone 1.52, and we've actually reached our capacity on, on mining, apparently. Let's fix that, shall we? Because we did, thankfully, already mark out a space to put a new storage over here, so oh, not a wood pile, it's mining pile, that's what I'm looking for. Level 20 wood chopper, Margaret. Hooray! Congrats. Oh, I'm running out of actual things to mine over here as well. I'll have to mark out some more territory there. Whew. Anybody I don't recognize wandering the roads? No. Looks like everybody's accounted for. Any wolves? Any other monstrosities for me to be concerned about? That's the next question, isn't it? Turn of spiders. Let's mark these out. Resource gathering. We don't really need their resources, but might as well grab them. You never know when you might need them. Like if there's a fire in the storage shed. Although if there is a st is, if there is a fire in the storage shed, then we have way bigger concerns. We never want to get rid of these corpses because oh boy, there's a lot of them. Again, we probably won't get very much from skeletons, but me might as well. Might as well. I see something in the distance. Is it a chicken? It is. Ooh, and we definitely need to send somebody to out, like, to go and pick them up, but yeah, for now we're good. Alright. So, as I'm recording this, it is only the 19th, uh, but this video will go out on the 27th, so consequently, I am left wondering what might have happened in between that might have, that might colour my, uh, ideas of what to talk about. And jeez, over 2,000 food. Blimey. Uh, oh, we don't get more shingles. Hmm. Should get that working. Let's see. Shingles. Four requires wood. Six. Or wait, no, it'll be wood planks. Two, then. Put 200 on that. And 200 there. Okay. Ha! Huh. So, yeah, I don't know what's going down. I know something is happening today, which I hope I have good news by the time this video goes up from. We'll find out. Um, that's in the political sector, though, so I won't talk about it terribly too much. Uh, but what I do know is that Christmas will have happened and people will be looking towards the avenues of adventure inside of 2017. Um, I know The Lost Hands will have started to go out, we'll, we'll have seen a few episodes of that by now. Uh, hope you're enjoying that, in which case. Um, so I thought I'd sit down and I'd have a chat about things that I'm hopeful to get going in 2017. So, first on my list for 2017 is to get merchandise rolling. So that means that I will be talking to some people about some things to try and get posters, t-shirts, that kind of thing. One thing I'm really, really interested in finding out if we can organize it before 2017 uh, is actual, like, a plushie. Um, even if it's just one plushie, if it ends up being like the witch or something, um, just a plushie because Hugs are a big thing in my community, and the most I can give people for hugs most of the year is just, uh, like, asterisk, hugs, asterisk, and being able to have a physical object that people can hug would be really nice, I think. People would, li people would like that and appreciate that, and I would be happy to provide such a service. Um, so yeah, merch is the first thing on my list for 2017 to try and get sorted. Uh, obviously sorting it out at this point in December is not going to happen, but it's been a busy while. It's been a busy while. Uh, another thing, of course, is the schedule change-up, uh, so I want to try and hit the ground running a little bit with that, <laughs> hopefully. Hopefully it won't take me a month to sort myself out on that one. Uh, and that will mean that content comes out in a big bulk in the middle of the week, so you can all enjoy it, and then catch up over the weekend without worrying about missing anything. Um, which also will be in line with a lot more standard kind of uh, production routines of other YouTubers who aren't 
making it just daily. I don't know how people do it, but yeah. one of these days I might actually hit that tier on the Patreon for it. Uh, speaking of the Patreon, I'm thinking of doing a rewrite of that. Uh, I'm not going to stop it, and I'm not going to change, like, vast swabs of it, but just a slight reorganizing, because, for example, we hit the redesign the website more or less within a week of the Patreon going up, and that is still outstanding. And so that means that I need to find a web developer, I need to discuss pricing, discuss elements of the website, we need to change, that kind of thing. Because I'll, I'll be kind of honest, the website is a little bit of an, of an embarrassment for Remember Comics right now. Because it is very old, and it only caters to the webcomic, which doesn't get updated nearly as frequently as I would like it to. Uh, I'd like to keep the webcomic, like, as a thing. I would like to keep it there, and then just every time I actually have the time, uh, do a little drawing stream and then get a page out for it. But uh, obviously the focus of content these days is on the videos. So that needs to be the focus of things. Uh, on the website as well as elsewhere. And I don't think I even had a Twitter account when that website went up, so that needs to be added as well. Suffice to say, there's a bunch of stuff that needs to get changed on the website, and it's been a long, long time coming. Uh, so I need to talk to people to get that going, so that's on my list as well. Uh, but since the website plays such a small role, it is on the lower end of things. Ooh, level 19 Carpenter Frerin! Congrats, you are nearly max level. Uh, let's see, what else? What else do I want to happen in 2017? Well, one thing I was hoping to get a look into, um, was not a drone. <laughs> I know I'd like to have a drone, but I cannot justify it at all. Uh, especially not where I live, because flying a drone out here, it will get nicked. Um, but I would like to try and get into some digital animation a bit more. Um, I've never touched that. My university was actually known for it, but that was in the art side of things, not the, uh, well, I suppose parts of the video game development such, such, but I was a programmer, not an artist, so. I'm just flying around willy-nilly here, so. <laughs> Apologies, I don't really know who to be looking at, because there isn't terribly much going on. It's just sort of, we're working to get this going a bit more. How are we with the bodies? The bodies have been removed from the floor, for the most part, it seems. Very good, very good. Um, yes, where was I? Um, one thing I know is that the, I think it's the PlayStation Connect, um, has the facility for doing motion capture. Uh, freeform motion capture, just basically you're in a room and it's pointed at you. So between that and some relatively easy to come by software, uh, I should be able to start doing animations. And I don't, I should stress that I don't mean I'm going to start putting out animated, like, clips and whatnot from videos, although that'd be fun. Um, I would like to have it be the occasional special thing. Like, maybe that'll feature in the, in the, the, uh, the June specials for 2017. I don't know yet. Um, but it would make for some more interesting intro sequences. Like, right now we mostly just have... Uh, a piece of, uh, a piece of, admittedly rather aging artwork uh, <laughs> that just serves as the intro to a lot of my series. So it'd be nice to have actual like animation and like footage, There's something a bit more motion, a bit more life to it. Um, but I don't actually have the, I don't have the computer capacity to make those like a big regular common thing. Not have the skills for it, jeez. Um, but that's a thing that's on my list to investigate in 2017. Also on that list is to get some art assets. So there's a number of artists that I am very interested in talking to, um, to try and get some more diverse, more up-to-date kind of art assets. Uh, I'm not thinking of like a remodeling or rebranding in the whole sense, but a new, a new like, uh, banner for the a new banner for the Twitter and the actual channel will be good. Uh, but also like some custom emoticons or emotes or emojis or however you want to name it um, for like the Twitch and whatnot. Getting getting partnered on Twitch would be a nice little headline for 2017. I don't know if that'll happen, but the Twitch streams are one avenue where I want to improve the quality of my. Uh, events and whatnot. How are we doing down here? 
Yeah, we're still chugging along. We're nearly at the actual world edge, but we haven't got the bricks currently to finish it off the quite a ways off of it. Ooh, Samara's level up. Hooray! Everyone's getting level ups for Christmas, apparently. <laughs> Or winter's harvest, I don't know what you'd want to call it around here. We're in a constant state of harvest, really, so it's hard to tell. Let me see, what else do I want to try and get done in 2017? Hmm. Um. Knowing... Oh, hello. Of course. Oh, grand. Two camps. Two camps right on... And there's Warks. There are wargs. There's two wargs. Grand. Okay, where are we looking here? Anything around here? No. Good. There's nothing by the northern road. Grand. Um, there's two by the eastern, but they're both melee, so they'll probably fall over quite quickly. The two wargs, however, have me a concern. Now, I'm fairly certain... That penguin can take a warg. Level 16 inventory. In, in, inventory? <laughs> in, infantry. Uh, bronze, iron, bronze, iron, bronze. You should be pretty well to do. Uh, so hopefully you'll catch them. Uh, I'm going to send you uh, two at once, though, is the, is the problem. I'm not terribly convinced about two at once, but we'll find out. Uh, are you eating? Currently, no, we are fine for hunger. Good. Okay. Uh, ee. Anyway, as I was saying, I do know of a couple of series that will be going down in the course of uh, 2017. Oh, jeez, these guys can completely outrun my infantry. This is not going to go well. If I'm not careful. This will be going quite terribly, in fact. Um, be paper over this way, please. <laughs> okay, we're about to spot one of these guys at least. I hope. There we go, spotted. And the other one's over there. Okay. Everybody else can't really handle these guys, so I need to hit them down quickly. Um, I yeah, I have an idea for at least two different series that will be going down. And the doggo goes well. Okay. Next one. Oh, he's headed for the wall. Uh, I don't want him over there. I don't want him over here. Uh-uh. If he comes over here, he's gonna find a bunch of people. All of my miners, in fact. Okay, while this is going down... <laughs> miners! To the town hall. All miners to the town hall. Pronto. I know that you're trying to currently go and, like, off-loot some stuff, but please, please, get away from this. Uh... Samara, that includes you. You're not a miner, but... I do want you out of, the, out, out of harm's way here. And how far off is paper? Okay, there we go. Just straight over here. Okay, he's running away. That's good. Okay, we're getting close. I think we're about to spot. There we go, spotted. Hey, need more building card. Not surprising, okay. Oh, come on, paper. Whoa, that was close. That was close. But not to worry, paper. Your shift is current is approaching an end anyways. Oh boy. Okay, so as I was saying, before that happens, and we still got two more to deal with, I think. You know, there's one there, and there's one just in the waters over there. Not quite sure where he thinks he's headed, but he's going to have a nasty surprise when he gets there. Um, yeah, I've got like two different series that I know are happening in the course of 2017, including, of course, the specials. Um, well, 13 stone mason, Dallas, hooray. 
They're just floating over here. Okay, uh, Seth, can you come over here, please? Which one? No preferred. This is going to be interesting. I mean, you can't climb up here. I know that. Like, I know straight up that is impossible. But, I mean, you're welcome to try, I guess. We are never going to be able to collect your goods. There we go. Dead as a doornail. Uh, standing guard position. Okay. So, dis dispose of corpse. I can't get at that at all. <laughs> uh, and then there was one archer that I maybe have to worry about, but will probably be okay. Because, for one thing, he's way over there on his lonesome. Um, which Ivy is approaching. Uh, scratch that. Uh, paper? Where is paper? Oh, no, penguins. Okay. Penguin's good. Let's bring Penguin over here to deal with this, then. Uh, so yeah, I know that's going down. Those are going to be fun. At least one of them requires me to voice every character in it, again. Um, which is not the June special, believe it or not. That'll be fun. Um... I honestly don't know what's going to happen with my content in 2017 too much, um, beyond the re revisions and reorganizings and whatnot. Okay, so, no. Back, back, back. Ooh, I need to build more building cards, don't I? So let's grab one and put it where it needs to be. Just whilst this is going on, you know, the standard thing. Uh, and where is Penguin? Penguin is right there. Grand. Yeah, can I grab Penguin, please? Thank you. And here's the dude in question. <clears throat> um... Yeah, I'm not 100% sure on what titles are even coming out in 2017 at this stage. I have been very busy with a number of other things, including getting the Lost Hands ready to go. Uh, so who knows? I'm not generally one to play games as they're coming out, but maybe something will grab my attention. We'll see. Um, more multiplayer, or at least multi-person, would be good to see. That does entirely depend upon wrangling people into a schedule, and since I don't exactly have an office space or something to do that with, that gets to be quite difficult for me. I do want to be doing more work with uh, Kieran Dave, because I really love Dave. Um, he does have a kid and a fairly large chunk of business to work on, but uh, I'd like to be doing some more stuff with Dave again. Who knows? I might even try and wrangle doing some stuff with the old Chaos villains. I don't know. Uh, Definitely we're going to be seeing some interesting stuff happening with Dungeons & Dragon Hats, Path of Steel. That campaign is only going to get bloodier, and I'm recording this literally the day after we've lost uh, two different party members. In one encounter, no less. In fact, one of them had his brains sucked out. Okay, we should be able to take this guy. Are we going to take this guy? Can you see this guy? Come on, spot the guy. There we go. Okay, this should go fairly straightforward. Just strafe, 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 strafe. That's gonna get you. Nope, 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 nope. Stab! Who? Okay, it's fine. You're about to go to bed. Level 12 Carpenter, Hazar. Right. Oh, we've had some bruises today. Criminy. But then it's hard to, like, it's it's hard to blindside works, because they are just so quick. So unbelievably quick. And Blair's 11, eight. I say 11, 8 minor. Hurrah. Is that one of ours? That is, yes, it's Aku. Aku is on shift. Okay. So, we are now on a night shift with our patrols. Night shift has full health, because they've just spent the... Oh, have we had a fishing rod break? Apparently. Um... Night Shift is on full health because they haven't been wandering around fighting things lately, so yay. Uh, and let's also get some rope because we need it. There. Um, 
Oh, where the lights are going on. Hurrah. How nice. We should see people going to sleep soon enough. And yeah, hopefully I won't want to hear this, the distant sound of fire. Uh, so that should be all of the goblins. Jeez, they didn't take long to get rid of, did they? Less than an episode. Uh, and yes, there is nothing else up here. Good. Uh, Ivy, I need to introduce you to a standard routine here. Carry a torch, please. So that we know where you are at night. Because you're a walking beacon in the darkness, basically. <sighs> right. Well, uh, let me know, actually, what kind of things you'd like to see me uh, be doing in 2017. What are your expectations for 2017? What things are coming up in 2017 that you are interested to see my take on? I'm very curious to find out. Um, most of the time I roll with the punches and come up with RPs in games that aren't necessarily young, but <laughs> uh, should entertain people nonetheless. But with that, this has been Edgington. It is rapidly approaching the end of day 47. Who is complaining this? This is Trip. Okay. Uh, yeah, rapidly approaching the end of day 47. And I hope you've enjoyed. I'll catch you all next time.